Hi everyone, I'm back again with good news and an update regarding HIV treatment and management. So, the MHRA, which stands for Medicine and Healthcare Products Regulatory Agency, has officially authorized or approved new cabotegravir formulations to help prevent HIV infections in adults and adolescents. So this significant advancement was literally approved three weeks ago. Uh, to be specific, that's on the 3rd of May 2024. The, all this is on an official government website, which after this video you can go and check uh, and confirm. So the carbotegravir has been authorized in two formulations. The first one as tablets, which comes in 30 milligrams and then the second formulation is as a long acting injection administered every two months so currently the tablet based prep is already available for those at risk of hiv infection and now the carbotegravir 600 milligram long acting injection is the first injectable treatment approved to help hiv1 infection in the uk so let me explain how this is done the carbotegravir 600 milligram long acting injection is administered by a nurse i'm a nurse or a doctor into the buttock muscle six times a year first the patient receives one injection monthly for two months so let's say for example january and february you receive one injection in january and another injection in february and then after that it reduces to one injection every two months so in total in a year you have six injections so before starting the injections patients can take the tablet every day for one month while in consultation or in monitoring uh, with your doctor to assess whether it's appropriate to proceed with the injection. So uh, obviously as everything there is some side effects. So with the medication the side effects is feeling headache, diarrhea, feeling hot and changes in liver function. With the injection, there's not much uh, side effects. It's just you may feel pain or discomfort at the injection site. I personally think this is really amazing news for HIV management and prevention. This news is actually on www.gov.uk website. You can access it anytime and get more information from there. But as always, please remember to look after yourself, use protection, safe sex, try to stick with your with one partner and uh, speak to your healthcare providers if you have any concerns. Uh, and I'll see you on my next one. Thank you for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, share and leave a comment. Bye for now. Bye. See you. Wow.